Hi everyone, welcome, Coach Moore is here. Today we're gonna be doing a short session of mobility and stretch on the Swiss ball. So let's get started on sitting on the ball, feet forward and place your hands on your hip bones. And let's just start with pelvic tilt. So we wanna roll the pelvis forward and back. I'm gonna show it sideways so you can see exactly what I'm doing with my pelvis. Forward tilt and backward tilt. So the ball is rolling backwards a little bit and forward underneath you. Just keep rocking the pelvis back and forth. Try to stay nice and tall. Breathe, inhale and exhale. And now side to side, move your hips from side to side. Arms, you can hold your arms out to the side. Think about lifting your hip up towards your armpit. Hiking the hip. And now circles all the way around. Nice full circle, moving through all directions and reverse. All the way around. One more. And come back to center. Place one hand on the ball and then stretch up and over. Let the ball roll over to one side. And then go in and reaching out. And keep moving side to side. Exhale as you lengthen out and stretch and in, reaching out and in. Two more. Hold. Grab the ear, point the head over to the side and circle the head to go all the way around. Nice full circle. Stay down with the head. And now from here, we're gonna roll down slowly. Hands on, up on your thighs, rolling down, and then into a flat back, coming back up. Shoulders over the hips. So initiate it from the pelvis. Roll round spine, rolling down. Lengthen through the spine and up. So it's like a wave in the body. Going down and out. Inhale, exhale as we go down. Breathe in and roll. Yeah, so sideways, it's gonna look like this. Down with a round spine, up with a flat back. And one more, stay down. In a nice flat back, just like a tabletop, shoulders down away from the ears. Go ahead and push, straighten through the knees, and bend. Exhale, try to keep your back in a neutral, flat position, so you, you don't wanna flex the spine as you push. That might happen if your hamstrings are very tight, so you might wanna go up a little bit. And straighten the knees, and bend straight and in one more and bring yourself all the way up all right let's do the other side so we started with a side stretch over to the other side and let's move it in and out and reach let the ball roll from side to side and in and lengthen and in and reach One more, stay there, hold the stretch. Grab the ear, bring the head over to the side with you. And circle the head slowly all the way around. Nice full circle. And coming up to center. We're gonna do the wave again, but we reversing it. So we're going down in a flat back and rolling up through round spine. So, send your sits bones out. 
Tilt your pelvis forward, flat back, and release. Exhale, roll it back up. And keep going. And one more, hold that nice flat back. And now, you wanna put your hands, grab your ankles, elbows from the inside, and one arm is gonna reach up and back, rotating the spine, look over your shoulder, and close, out of sight, open, and in, and again, open up, and exhale to close. Inhale to open. And in. And roll yourself up slowly. Walk your feet forward. Slowly walking forward. You want your back on the ball. And then just take a moment here to stretch back and over. And rock yourself back and forth. Enjoy that stretch. Arms can be out to the sides or back over the head. And slowly bring your head up. And walk your feet backwards, rolling up, back up to sitting. All right, now take your feet wide apart and bend over. You want your hands on top of the ball and then roll the ball back behind you. Stretch. Bend your knees, flatten the back. So nice flat back, tabletop. And then stretch, round spine. Reaching with the arms far back. And again, bend your knees. Nice tabletop, flat back. Exhale to straighten the legs and roll the ball further back. Your hands are on top of the ball. Let's do one more. Inhale. And exhale. Now take the ball in front of you, roll it through the side, and stretch it here. Bend your knees, and again, we're gonna round the spine, nice C curve, and lengthen out. Breathe out. And out. Exhale. Lengthen out through the spine. One more. Now, flat back. You want to extend your back. Roll the ball underneath you. Open and stretch it out. And again, roll the ball. Bring it right underneath the chest. Open, flat back. Your knees are bent. And release. And again open one more and hold the ball right underneath you right here now you want the one palm is gonna face on the on top of the ball with the palm facing up to the ceiling and the other arm out to the side you're gonna rotate through the spine roll the ball over to the side twisting spiraling and center Switching hands. So you want the back of the hand on the ball, other arm out to the side, roll the ball over to the side, open the other arm. It feels so good. Let's do it one more. On each side, again the back of the hand on the ball, and roll over to the side, open the chest, and center. Other side, open, open, open. And center and go down on the knees so we're gonna go over the ball here just rock yourself back and forth a few times just relax and let's find center so you want your weight to be uh, evenly on the hands and the feet. And now from here, we want to take the right hand or the left hand centered, open the other arm, 
And again, we're gonna rotate the spine, turn on the side, and open. Look over your shoulder and close it in. Same thing on the other side. Open the arm, look over. Exhale to close. Let's do one more on each side. Inhale as we open. And close. One more. Oh. And in. Now bring the hands up on the ball. Your knees are slightly bent. And you want to push yourself off the ball to stretch the front of your body, the abdominal wall, your hip flexors. Reach one arm back, up and over the head. And see if you can bring the other arm and arm through the side, release it all the way down. Again, just hug the ball and relax. Go down on the knees, sit back on your heels and stretch it forward. You can roll from side to side, a little bit, open. And roll yourself up. All right, now let's stretch the chest muscles a little bit. So you want one arm on the floor. So on all fours, basically one hand stays on the floor. The other arm is on top of the ball in a 90 degree elbow and shoulder. Okay, you want the ball to support your shoulder here. Now bend the standing elbow, lower the body down, and think about uh, rotating, twisting away from the ball. You're gonna feel a nice gentle stretch on the side of the ball, the arm that's on the ball. Breathe, relax. And come up close to the other side. So arm, 90 degree, shoulder, elbow on the ball. Go ahead and bend the standing elbow, arm, Bring your chest closer to the ground and think about twisting away from the ball a little bit. Take a moment here. And release. All right, one more stretch. You want the palms, the back of your hands both on the ball. Take the ball away from you. So we're stretching the lat muscles here, the big back muscles. And go ahead and roll the ball away from you here. So the palms turned up, uh, facing up to the ceiling. Reaching out, your hips should be over your knees. You don't wanna sit back here. You can rest the forehead down on the ball. And slightly, make sure you're not hyperextending the back. You want to tuck the tailbone under just a little bit. Nice long arms. And slowly roll yourself up. All right, and that was it for today. A short sequence stretching on the ball. It was mostly upper body. Next time we'll do more uh, lower body stretch with a ball. Thank you so much for joining me again. I'll see you in the next video. Bye now.